President Moon Jae-in on Tuesday held the first cabinet meeting of his administration, though it's a cabinet that remains incomplete. In the meeting, he announced several new nominations, including one for Justice Minister, his second nominee for that post, after his first choice withdrew over ethical issues. Jim Myung gil starts us off. One of the main things to come out of President Moon Jae-in's first cabinet meeting was the president's selection of Park Sang-gi, a law professor from Yonsei University, as his new pick for justice minister. Park advocates reforming the prosecution and judicial system and currently heads the Citizens Coalition for Economic Justice, a civic organization pushing for fair income distribution. President Moon also named the new chief of the Anti-Corruption and Civil Rights Commission, Park Eun-jung. She is a professor at Seoul National University and President Moon sees her as the right person to protect civil rights and root out corruption. The job is considered a ministerial post, but unlike cabinet posts, does not require a parliamentary hearing. The latest appointments also include a new vice minister, Lee Jin-gyu, for the Ministry of Science, ICT and Future Planning. He has been promoted from within the ministry and is known for his ability to coordinate policies. As well as announcing his new cabinet nominations, President Moon urged the lawmakers to approve the government's 10 billion U.S. dollar supplementary budget that is stuck in limbo at the National Assembly. Uh, he said the extra budget will not only help create new jobs and mitigate damage caused by the ongoing severe drought, but may even lead to a period of economic growth in the 3% range. Opposition parties, however, remain skeptical of the bill and its potential burden on taxpayers. Jim Young-gil, Arirang News.